Hey everyone, Weber here. I'm the founder of Flora. Today I'm going to show you the basics of how it works. So Flora is quite simple. You have three types of blocks, text, image, and video. You can spawn it from the left parameter bar, double click anywhere to spawn it, or use the keyboard shortcuts TIV for text, image, and video respectively. So with each of these nodes, you can type in here and this will activate text to image. So activate text to video, and this will activate text to text. So here, let's choose, let's generate something here. Here you'll see all the different types of models. So we can choose Flux Pro for now. Here you'll see different aspect ratios. This will enhance the prompt and this will save to the left parameter bar. You can also export and expand later. And this is variations, which I won't touch on for now, but it lets you generate more styles similar to this. So you can go down stylistic rabbit holes. Here you can choose how many generations you want. So if I click four, it would generate four at once. For now, let's just do one. Here you'll see a text node. You can do things like connect an image into this and then describe it, for instance, which is really useful. Or you can just use it like a typical text to text node. Here we have video. So you also have Sonnet and GPT here. That's kind of a gnarly image. But yeah, here you'll see we have our video node. Because I put image into this, this is now using image to video models. If this was not, were not connected, this would be text to video. So here you'll have some examples of the best models here. Let's choose this for now. I'll also quickly show what it looks like when you spawn many at once. You'll see this here. Uh, on the left parameter bar here, we have your assets bar, where you'll see the things you uploaded, um, the things you saved, uh, your generation history of all your past generations. Here you'll have comments. So let's say, hello. On the top right here, you have real-time multiplayer. So when other people are in this project, you'll see folks here. You can also copy your link and share it with someone else and they can come into your project or you can publish your project to community so other people can fork it as well. So that's kind of a quick overview of how the nodes work. I'm gonna delete this real quick just to show you one last thing. Here we have flows. So this is examples of pre-made workflows that can get you started. You can also click them here. So let's go with cinematic storyboarding for now. And here you'll see a populated example of how you might use Flora. But of course, there are many different ways to use text, image, and video models to uh, build really interesting creative workflows. But yeah, that's kind of a quick overview of Flora. Um, we had a lot of fun making it, and I'm excited to see what you all create with it. Cheers.